Hello everybody, cool down the here. GG, how's everybody doing? Hey guys, the channel is improving. Now we got a chair to make the videos, so I don't have to be in my knees. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Let me get a drink. It's kind of hot down here in Florida. All right, my friend. I got some news for you guys. Do you guys remember the issue with the rotor? This issue. I got it short because a lot of people are going to be watching this video. They don't know about it. So I'm going to have to explain a little bit. But this issue here with the rotor. You hear that? Those rivets are getting loosened. You see, when I bought the fat boy, it will not do this. It will just out. But once I, I started riding it, it started getting loose. The one in the back is solid, but this one, the one in the front, it's always, they already replaced it once. They give me hard time to do it, but I got it to replace it. So then when I went back and I showed this, that it's doing the same thing again, uh, they didn't want to replace it. So I've been, very upset about that. And I let it know that I was upset about it because they were giving me hard time. And this is a brand new motorcycle. This is the 2021, and you can see, 2021 model, fat boy. But guys, they told me, last time, they told me that no, go ahead and go ahead and ride it uh, a few months, three or four months or six months, something like that. They told me, and it's gonna tie it up. It's gonna fix itself. It's gonna tie it up. The metal is gonna tie it up, so it's not gonna do that anymore. I didn't believe it, and I even told it. I'm not a mechanic, but that's not. It's gonna get worse. It's gonna be moving more because it's gonna get. The metal is gonna get more loose. It's gonna get more uh, dissipated, more more eat up, more old. It's gonna up close more, and it's gonna make more noise. So it didn't make any sense to me, but I didn't want to argue anymore because they even called the factory, and the factory didn't want to replace it. So it's been a few months already. So. What I did, guys, I call, before I, I go to a dealer, I called the factory. And I'm gonna post the video because I record myself with the person in the factory talking about this issue to see what was their recommendation about it. If they are willing to help me to see what they said because a lot of people on the channel have commented, no, I send it to a factory, call the factory, that dealer doesn't want to help you. My dealer here, Peterson, my local dealer, Peterson, Harley Davidson. Well, I called the factory and I'm going to post the video so you guys can hear all the conversation. But in this video, I'm going to tell you that the factory told me that there's nothing that they can do about it, that for me to go back to the dealer and ask the dealer, show him again this one and ask the dealer the opinions and if the dealer agrees that it needs to be changed that the dealer will call them and they will replace it let me get another drink this is very annoying you see here I have video there when you look I'm gonna show you how annoying is this guy if it's not annoying for you, that's okay with me. Don't don't come to me telling me that that that's okay with you. That and your bike is doing the same and you're happy with it. Good for you. Not for me. It's very annoying. Watch this. Watch this. You think that it? 2021 motorcycle, brand new, not even a thousand miles, should sound like that? Really? Okay. 
I don't agree with that, but that statement, but whatever you want to say. Guys, I went back to a dealer. Yeah. After all that fight, I went back to a dealer. I don't care. I want this to be fixed. Not only for me, for everybody else. For everybody else that planning to buy this brand new motorcycle and then gonna get in the same issue. It's gonna be the front or the back, or maybe the two, but they're gonna run through the same issue because those rotors, they told me that the best company, the, the best company that made rotor is the one that is making this rotor. I don't know the name. I'm pretty bad from the name, but, and I told him, yeah, it can be the best company, but anybody made mistakes. Anybody can make mistakes, and they're making mistakes here. Why? Because why the one in the back is solid. The one in the back is not making those noises. Look, I show you. For everybody that's new about this issue here. Here. The one in the back. The one in the back. See? Sound. Doesn't move. So, my reply to the to them over there, my reply to them over there, I get in my motorcycle. My reply to them over there, so which one is? Which one is good and which one is bad? Because they all should be the same. If they are gonna make that noise, my, my camera almost broke. If they are gonna be like this, so they are fine. But if they are gonna be like that, so the one in the back is bad. Right? The one in the back that isn't moving is bad. It's bad. Bad. So I went back to a dealer, and you know what they tell me? They called the factory again. Well, first he checked it. He checked it, he went like this. And when he hear that, he said, that sounds normal to me. The same guy that was in the video in the last one, the same guy that said that no, that was not normal, that opened the eyes and said, no, that, was, that wasn't normal. This time, he came right at me, and this one is making probably more noise than the first one. He said that that was normal. And I said, did something change, got in your head or something with your, your respect? How are you gonna tell me that? He said, well, yeah, it's within the range. I said, what? What range? How come the one in the back doesn't do that? Oh, no, but, but this one is within the range. They, they're supposed to move some. And I said, so the one in the back is bad because it's not moving? No, that one is good, but because this one is moving, it's within the moving allowance. However, what he was saying, you see, guys, it's all BS, all BS. That's an authority. That's not right, that's wrong, that's bad, but you guys don't want to keep replacing it. You guys replace it at one, and you guys don't want to replace it because you guys don't want to fix it. You, you don't want to go through, like you said, from 10, 15, or 20 until you find one that is, that is solid, right? He said, no, yeah, we cannot go have you here every 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 month and changing the rotor for you. Then everybody's gonna come and I said, Doesn't matter. This is an issue. It gotta be fixed. For me and for everybody else. Maybe I'm the one, the only one that's coming here to back about it, but more people are gonna come later. Don't you wanna have you go somewhere happy? No, yeah, but I already called the factory and they said no that it cannot be changed. It can that they, they're not gonna uh, order to change it because it's within the range. That movement within the range. I said, well, that move, that range, it sucks because I don't want that range movement in my, in my brand new motorcycle. It sucks. I told her like that. He said, no, but it's something that we can do. I said, well, how about that solid rotor that you guys offered me last time, that if I wanted to replace it, we can replace that one for a solid one, 
and that will take care of no rivers, just a solid disc, a solid rubber. Go ahead and tie all this. I don't want to keep back and forth with you guys. I want to take care of this. I don't want that in my motorcycle. Ah, okay, no problem. I was ready to bite the bullet, right? I have to look at my book to show you which one is and how much is. Say, yeah, I think that you told me like $500, but go ahead, look at your book. I'll be outside. I'll feel more comfortable outside. You let me know. Say, so, okay. So I go outside, I sit outside for a good 25 minutes. And he comes outside and he say, scratching his hair because he's not bald like me. He had hair. He was, you know, <laughs> he was scratching his hair. He said, sorry, Ray. But we don't even we don't have that one either. I said, "What? You told me from the last time that if I wanted, you guys would change it for a solid one that doesn't have rivers. Now you coming to me that you don't even have that one? It's not that one aftermarket." He said, "Yeah, but the aftermarket company that we use, they don't they don't make it." I said, "So." I'm out of gas, right? He said, yeah, kinda. He said, really? So I have to stick with this crap for the as long as I have the motorcycle with the freaking rotten making noises and I don't have a choice to change it to a solid like you guys said to me before. He said, well, it's nothing that we can do about it. <laughs> I said, can you take it off from my motorcycle? I don't want it there. I take, I take my motorcycle without it. He said, no, we cannot do that. We cannot take it out and give you the motorcycle without it. I was so mad, so pissed off. Said, okay, something that you can do, but I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. Give me the key. So I took my key and left. And now, I'm not giving up. I'm gonna find another way. So I have some ideas or something that I'm going to do, but this video is getting kind of long, and I just wanted to tell you guys the one that already had the motorcycle and the one that are gonna forge a new one to beware and know what's going on. There is no fixing, they're not gonna wanna replace it for you, and they're not gonna replace it for a solid one because they don't make it or they don't have it or they like he said the aftermarket company that they work with they don't have it they don't make it they're not making it yet i said oh i asked him do you think that they're gonna make it in the future he said he doesn't know so maybe in the future they're gonna make it but for now that's the answer that my local dealer here pitting so hard in them so he's giving to me Guys, this is unbelievable. This is a big piece of, you know what? Unbelievable. I bought the motorcycle from, it's not that I'm bringing this problem to them. Here, I got this motorcycle in another place and I come in with this problem, hold me out, no. I bought this motorcycle with them, all these upgrades that I had done with them. So, for you guys be aware that it's a serious situation and it's not gonna be an easy pass for you guys, the one that have it and the one I'm, going, I'm planning to buy a new motorcycle. So I already have some idea of something that I'm going to be doing. So I'm gonna post this video. I hope uh, it, serve, it give you some good answers for you and uh, to give you, to get people aware of the situation. And please, if you think that this video is giving you good information, give it a like so it, it get to other people. This information, we need to pass it on, guys. We need to pass it on to other people. That's the whole purpose. Not just for the few that it get to you and that's it, and you listen and, 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 and you get the idea and you're aware of the problem. No, let's give it a like. So more people get aware please 
help of other people do. Because I'm walking in this, but the idea is to get this to other people. So what, maybe we get together, maybe the more people that watch it, it's better because maybe some people are there that want to help, help us out, okay? I'm not, I'm not stopping, I'm not giving up. This is going to get fixed, I promise you, 100%. I'm not freaking giving up. They can give up on me and my situation, but I'm not giving up. I'm going to get this taken care of. So, but this is not going to take all my sleep. I'm still going to be cool dandy. And I'll see you in the next video. My GG cool people. So I'll see you in the next one. And I'll be posting that video from the person from the uh, factory. So you guys can hear everything. All the BS that they're telling me. Okay? GG and I don't know this look it's